Hello guys, welcome back to my channel DP Design and in this video I am going to teach you how to unlock the step files, IGS files, okay. Sometimes you receive the files in the format of IGS, Parasolid and steps. So as you can see this feature in care softwares, how to unlock it. If you want to modify any feature, okay, there, there will be an error or there will be one solid body which you cannot change, right. So what you have to do? Let's say I'm saving this part at a, as a step file in desktop and trash. Okay. Let's say this is my bill crank saving as a step file. Okay. Yeah. Now I will open this. As you can see, as you can see, this is the only solid file where I cannot find the features which have been applied on this part so I cannot change the hole I cannot change any extrude okay I cannot change any Bosch so how to do it suppose I have to change this geometry completely so what I have to do I, I, I have to sketch here and do so many operations to change that but to unlock this step file I will show you the way just save is up as a parasolid if that file is a parasolid then you don't need any other file parasolid is enough now i will open this parasolid file which i have saved right now what i will filter yes parasolid and open now it will showcase feature works do you want to proceed with feature recognition or not okay simply i will say no right now because i will do it manually otherwise you can just uh, say yes and it will start I will just say no because I want to show you how to do it manually you click in an imported part and there will be options of feature works okay this plugin helps a lot to recognize the features of uh, any other from if part is from SOLIDWORKS only or if any uh, from any other care software so you can just click on recognize part there will be a lot of options like automatic interactive if you know the features are standard and you know every feature then you can just go to interactive and sheet metal features if you know okay you don't have to try that if you don't know anything about the part next step is the automatic features what it should recognize let's say extrude volume drafts revolves so sometimes what people do they don't check the drafts and volume so if the part having the drafting feature so they will face an error in surfaces right so you have to click all it will take some time but it will be worth it right it is recognizing the feature it has recognized the all the operations we have done in the part in SOLIDWORKS right so you can all uh, the patterns we have find and now what you can do you, you can just do ok and it will automatically generate the part but as you can see it's doing the magic right so you don't have to work for the features you don't have to make another part the same with the operations that's how you can unlock the part and sometimes what happens if you uh, import the part from any other care software like nx creo so if the feature is not there then you can do manual operation then you can delete the solid body and whatever operations you have you can keep it as it is and you can do that particular operation which is not in the SOLIDWORKS but in the CREO right so that's how you can do the feature recognition which will save your time and give you the features you want and it will be easy to modify your part okay so that's all for the video uh, thank you for watching keep sharing keep learning